Hey y'all, up here at uh, Floyd Garrett's Muscle Car Museum, and uh, it's Mopar Day, I guess. Um, this yeah, has all kinds of cool cars in here. If you ever get in the area, make sure you stop by here, tell Floyd I said hi, but um, you want to see all original muscle cars, classic cars, nice stuff, rare stuff, stuff most likely you won't see anywhere in the world. You stop by and see Floyd's up here at the, the Floyd Garrett Muscle Car Museum. But uh, today what I want to show you is this uh, Survivor. It's a 71 Plymouth GTX, and... Um, you know, it's all original, including the paint. So, anyways, let me get this thing set up, and we'll take a look at it. This is a really cool car. Here's the sandwich board on it. Get that close enough, and maybe y'all can uh, pause it and read it. But, it's unrestored. It looks like it's only had two owners. Second guy, uh, Mr. Khan, Arthur Khan, bought it in 1998. And, uh... It's been in uh, storage ever since. It's only got 10,000 miles on it. It's a special ordered car, one of 347, and that's documented. Um, oh, it's, it's documented as the most heavily optioned GTX built in 1971. Huh? Wow. These were kind of, you know, in 71, the cars were getting bigger, you know, and uh, the muscle car era was winding down, but there were still some cool cars out there, this being one of them. I mean, who doesn't like the air grabber hood? How sweet is that? Of course, we're back to a yellow Mopar again. <laughs> if you tune into my channel, you know why I say that. Seems like every nice Cuda I found has been yellow for the longest time. It's just hard to believe that a car, especially a Chrysler, don't tell anybody, but they didn't, I mean, cars of the 70s and all were notorious rust buckets, and uh, Chrysler was no exception to that. But just a cool looking car, man. Got the old polyglass tires on it, you know. Let me get over the other side and see if maybe the window's open or if I can open that door over there. Well, let's see if this side open. There's plenty of room over here. Still kind of dark sorry about that one day though you stick around we're gonna have big lights and fancy equipment over here at Scotty DTV but right now when we're indoors and the interior is black there ain't much to see but believe me when I tell you it's nice yeah it's real nice it looks original and I don't mean that in a demeaning kind of way it just it just looks original doesn't look like it's been over restored or over taken care of you know what I'm saying something like a, even if they go and get OEM uh, seat covers or whatever to put on it you can still look at it and see that that's probably not what showed up in 71 but um this one when you look in it that's you know you think it looks original And for those of you that wonder if Floyd ever works, there you go. That is Floyd Garrett, right? I don't know. <laughs> I never know by the action he's taking right now. Sorry about that. Got to give Floyd a little ribbing when he's up here. He's working, getting ready to go to the shows. He usually will uh, tell me a little bit about these cars. And I like it because, you know, Floyd's such a character, you know. And, and, I mean, he's just a wealth of information on muscle cars and that era and all so i always enjoy the time i spend up here and having him tell me about the car i want to shoot but he's getting ready to go to a couple shows his cars have been invited to come out to uh some big shows and so not today scotty you didn't have time but i like that spoiler kind of reminds me of a ford like a comet or something you know it's a cool car man you don't see them you darn to sure don't see any of these for whatever reason, people like to, they save the Kudas, you know, they go through, they go, they go to hell and back to save a Kuda, but not so much of these, but that's a nice one, Survivor, like I said, all original, look at those air dams, how funny is that, I mean, back in the day, that was really cool, but now it's kind of bulky looking to what you would get or put on a car. 
And I wish the hood was open so I could show you that, but it's not, like I said, with Floyd being busy today, uh, I don't want to bother him. So, anyways, there you go. Again, if y'all get in the area, stop by, tell Floyd I said hi. Check out these muscle cars that he's got in here. The, like I said, if it's rare, nice, you know, it's going to be in the Floyd Garrett Muscle Car Museum. It's just a very cool place. Uh, right at 10 bucks to get in, and uh, it's well worth the money. So, anyways, hope you all have enjoyed it from the Floyd Garrett Muscle Car Museum. Uh, Unrestored 71 Plymouth GTX. Have a good day. See ya.